I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Oh my god. He did I believe he Max it. has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb I'm word back. for a wonderful photographic trick. Right back where I started this insane week. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe ever again. Come on, Max. Popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Kate. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm not into capturing your interest. That's kind of sick, isn't it? <sighs> I guess somebody hasn't had their coffee. Do you want to try again? Okay, okay, the Daguerrean process. Blah, blah, blah. Let's, uh, let's move on. Hmm? Uh, anyway, so the Daguerrean process made portraiture quite popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. You can learn more when you finish reading the assigned chapters. Jesus, Kate. Somebody needs to take some cold guys, medicine or something. Time to, submit a photo in the everyday time Heroes to change time. The winter to San Francisco, where you'll be fed by the First, let's, let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. Okay. Get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you're pretending not to see me. Bastard. Oh. <laughs> I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. David Madsen. Yes. All I need is David's number, and Jefferson is one text closer to life without parole. Did you know someday your pictures would actually alter time and space? I hope I still love photography when this is done. Don't confuse the art with you. This diary literally saved my life. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Found you. Five 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 six three zero eight two four three. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. And take Jefferson down fast. Mr. Madsen, you're after Rachel Amber. Mark Jefferson is guilty. His dark room is under Prescott's farmhouse. You know the location. He's sick and dangerous. Stop him. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson... You'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? Way too hard, darling, but don't worry. Oh, Victoria. We could have been friends. We still could. My phone is dead and I'm bored. Time to bust out my... Posey. Why did I give up on the word for image? Because I suck. But Mark Jefferson rules. Everybody in here loves him. But he only seems to care about Maxie. I want to hate her. But she wouldn't care. Envy is a sin, Vic. Get over yourself. It doesn't matter what happens to me. This fancy camera does not give you any extra talent, Victoria. Or excuses. You will not hurt Kate Marsh this time. Hell no. But don't worry, because I was good at this. This is the last time somebody bullies you, Kate. Oh, yeah! Hey, Kate. Love you. Hi, Kate. Oh, hey, Max. Kate, listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. So do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I, I don't know what to say. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. Oh, Max! Stop.
stop it. Jefferson Thanks. will be getting off on this. You always know the right thing to do. Yeah, I do. I am literally Captain Hindsight! <laughs> oh, Rachel. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Is she already dead at this point in time? Can we, um... Could we may maybe save her? Victoria. Victoria, I'm sorry you have to stand next to that psycho. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh. Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? I can see you're kissing ass again. Nothing new. What did you just say? Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? Not until Victoria knows that hiding behind a screen and posting videos of people is totally fucked up. You know how easy it is to hurt somebody? To destroy their life? Are you proud of yourself? If you have any feelings left, you should think about your actions. Listen, I, I didn't... Of course you did. You're so insecure, you can't even be happy with your own talent. You have to try and bring everybody down to your mean and ugly level. Okay, I do not have to listen to this bullshit. Do I, Mr. Jefferson? Well, it looks like you already did, Victoria. Then... I guess I'm done talking. I sure hope so. I'm not oh, going to say Max. I didn't enjoy that, but why? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No, it wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh, I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very... Happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell, the, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be innocent. Ah! Uh, well, thanks for the photo. And maybe both of us will be jet setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As oh, you're going I know. to find out, Mr. Jefferson. Oh, Max, you superstar! I think we've got everything here. So that didn't change. That didn't change. Good. That didn't change? Well... <laughs> That didn't change. Oh! oh! I forgot! Oh my god! Yes, Max! Oh, Rachel. I'm so sorry. Yeah, we did! Well, that was easy. <laughs> Is that that then? Are we done? Is that the end of polar polarized? The hell is going on now? Whoa! Where am I? What? What? Why am I on a plane? You're okay, Max. You're safe. On a plane. I wouldn't say safe. Oh, we're we going to Los Angeles for the competition. I hope I did everything right this time. Yes. <sighs> you did it, Max. It. Okay. Holy shit, you rule, Max. I'm so Chloe. proud of you, superstar. Oh, you're alive. Oh, you're alive. <laughs> yes! I did it. Yeah, you did! I fixed everything. Good job, baby. Well, sir. You're hella cool. <laughs> okay! 
Okay, time to relax and watch some in-flight entertainment. But first, to look out the window. It, it's so weird to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. The beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Wait. The beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. To Moon Diner, amid all of the environmental chaos in Acadia Bay, such as the unseasonal snowfall and beached whales, some residents reported seeing two full moons last night, around 8pm. Witnesses claimed the double moons were clear in the night sky until clouds covered them up shortly after they disappeared. No cell phone or video footage has surfaced yet, which has led local meteorologists to believe that imaginations are in overdrive due to the recent eco-havoc. Blackwell Security uncovers bunker and scandal. Acting on a series of tips from David Madsen, head of security at Blackwell Academy, police officers descended Tuesday <clears throat> on a bizarre underground bunk chamber. Allegedly used by teacher Mark Jefferson and student Nathan Prescott to drug, kidnap and photograph young women. Although there were no other signs of physical or sexual assault on the victims, the disturbing relations have sent shockwaves through the tranquil city of Arcadia Bay. I cannot read. <laughs> Even Sean Prescott, the most powerful businessman in the area, is under investigation for his role as owner of the farmhouse where the high-tech darkroom studio is located. Continued on the next page. I have to admit, I love being called an artist. Cool. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time. Hot Dog Man. When we were innocent. Stop it! I don't like that word anymore. It has to be shut off. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited too. Fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. <laughs> okay. Hey. How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. That's okay. Just a bit. <laughs> it's been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, Things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop whining. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco, but we all want you to have a great experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. This plane's coming down. Oh, Christ. Oh, no. Another nosebleed? Max, you're not just screwing oh, around no. the time. What's going on? What? Is this what's gonna happen? We're just gonna keep on jumping? Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one too. Save 
San Francisco is so cool. And this gallery is huge. So is the buffet. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as we don't have to eat any caviar. <laughs> this is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Work the room. Okay. I don't know. I, I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Max, after this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm going to eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Oh, thanks. I better get in there and start schmoozing. Thanks. You thanks, know, Principal I won't Wells. always be here to take charge. But you come talk to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. Wowzer, Max. You did it. Somehow. I went from the dark room to this gallery. I've been through so many realities in one week. Life is... weird. I can't see our name. There I am. Oh, there! Along with all the other winners. I should say artists instead. Yeah, you should. Hello? What is a hero? It's great to read all these comments. Even the mean ones. I cannot read any of this writing. Uh, so inspiring, not as good as last year's show, totally makes me want to start taking photos. Future of photography starts here. These heroes chose the path of least regret. Uh, a great example of total surveillance. Their 15 minutes are almost up. Thanks, this is so nice, inspiring stuff. Steve. Look at this print. The depth of the field. What the heck is going on here? That one is kind of silly. I would love to have this on a shelf. Someday. Why? He's like lunging. I like. Oh, but imagine how much time it takes to make one sculpture. Like, probably like 10 minutes. <laughs> Can he not look at any of this? Can I run? Okay, I can walk a bit faster. Hello! Aren't you from Blackwell Academy? I wanted to go there, but I didn't get in. They have such a cool program. I bet you're learning a lot. Uh... Well... Do you have anything else to say? Aren't you from Blackwell Academy? No, okay. Goodbye. They have such a <laughs> Anybody? Oh, hot dog man! Yes! Everyday heroes! <laughs> oh. Not anymore. That was so shocking. I Are you Max Caulfield? His work Bravo is on your entry. Cash. I'm the art critic for Iris N Magazine, and we would love oh. to include you in a piece about future trendsetters in photography. Yeah, sweet. I'll send you the details this week. Yeah. That's okay. Yeah, sure. Congratulations what? for your piece. Congratulations on your piece. If you know what I mean. I'm sorry. <laughs> Not my style, but the neon is a nice representation. Oh, shit. Pretentious alert. Yeah, I know, right, Max? Jeez, what's happened to you, huh? Up the stairs we go! I keep forgetting that I can go a bit faster. Hello, sir! Have you seen How my piece? How galleries afford to rent here? Um, okay. Hey. God, 
You must be the everyday hero from Blackwell. Yeah, I am. My name is Lauren Francis, and I run the media department at Detroit School of Visual Arts. You're not even looking I'd at me. I'd love to talk about you being a residency next spring. Oh. Don't say anything to Principal Wells yet. No, of course. Thank you. He's over there eating caviar. Um. I wonder if I can buy these everyday heroes pictures. Sorry, I don't know your name. But I saw your picture in the gallery brochure, and uh, I just wanted to let you know how cool your entry was. Oh, thank you. Uh, hello? That yeah. is different. Loving the retro vibe. Oh, hey! Look at how many people there are stood around my photo. Well, it kind of does. <laughs> Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least, for today. Oh, crap. I didn't even get to talk to everyone. Oh, no! Are you okay? We lost uh, you there for a second. Your nose. I'm okay. Uh, jet lag. High altitude. <laughs> Flight. Uh, engines. Uh, the oh, aviation ones. You're off, idiot. Oh, come on. Please answer. What? Oh, no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared! I'm, I'm by the beach! I'm Chloe! Sick. Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? How do we fix that? Oh my god. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit! Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is gonna be destroyed. <sighs> there has to be a way to stop this. For good. We're gonna have to go through our everyday contest, pi everyday hero contest picture, aren't we? Uh, come on. At least let's try and like big wig no ourselves fucking up. Way. Chloe no? can't die again. I have to save her. Yeah, we're going through the everyday heroes picture. How much would you pay for that? Here we go. Oh, I don't want to do this! It's so big and intimidating! Okay, Max. Uh, nobody look at me for a second. Excuse me, I'd love to ask you a few questions. Not now! Sorry, but... Yeah. 